Hi, my name is Dr. Palmer. I'm one of the naturopathic medical directors of the River Source. Uh, when patients and families to our facility, they will often ask us how we're going to medically treat not only the dr withdrawal from drugs and alcohol, but also their uh, loved ones' underlying uh, medical conditions that they're coming in with. What I'll generally tell these families and the patients is that we're going to use an integrative medical approach. Um, what that means is that we're going to use both conventional therapies to help treat the symptoms and, and disease, but we're also going to use alternative therapies. Um, by using this approach, the goal is that we're going to use um, things that are going to help treat the actual symptoms so the person's going to be comfortable as they go through their detox and you know, with all their other medical issues. Um, but we're also going to do things that are going to treat the whole person and is going to actually help with the root cause of whatever's going on. Um, people are often very concerned about what we're going to do for their drug withdrawal, which is completely um, a legitimate question because it's a scary and difficult thing to go through. Um, we do use an integrative approach to drug and alcohol withdrawal. Um, we use a lot of medications to help keep the person safe and stable as they go through detox. Um, it's one of our main goals and priorities um, as a medical team here. We also use a lot of alternative therapies um, to help them through those symptoms, but to also help their body heal. So some of the things that we're going to use are IV therapy, um, which can be really effective at helping to replenish the nutrients. Um, oftentimes when people are using drugs and alcohol, they tend to not be eating food. Um, they tend not to be drinking water, taking care of themselves. Sometimes they're not sleeping. Um, so replenishing these nutrients is really important just for the, the basic function of the body, but also the reproduction of the neurotransmitters in the brain, um, which then can help with drug withdrawal and anxiety, depression, things like that. Um, we also use a lot of botanical medicine um, to help calm people down, um, helps a lot with muscle pain, things like that. Um, we use homeopathic therapies, we use acupuncture, um, we've got massage therapists on hand, we use nutritional supplementation, we make sure that they're getting you know, good food and things like that. Um, the idea behind it, again, is that we're going to keep everybody safe and stable as they go through detox, um, but then we're also going to treat their symptoms and help lessen the detox severity um, so they're as comfortable as we can possibly make them be as they go through that detox. As for the underlying medical issues, um, most people come in with you know, anxiety, depression, chronic pain, things like that, um, and we're going to use that same integrative medicine approach to those uh, various complaints as well. So for something like anxiety, we're going to give them typically non-narcotic medications to help reduce the anxiety and that symptom, but then we're also going to utilize other therapies that are going to help you know, heal the whole person. So again, we're going to utilize the IV therapy and the acupuncture and botanical medicine, nutritional supplementation, all of that to kind of treat the person as a whole. Um, one of the nice things about the River Source is that we do have 24-hour medical staff. Um, our nurses are here all day, all night, um, so if any of our patients need anything at all, they are welcome to go and talk with the nurses and, and get that help, even if it's 3 in the morning, um, they're going to get that help. Our doctors are also here um, every single day, and when we're not here, we are on call, so we're available at any time for any consult. Um, you know, if the person is suffering and whatever the nurse is able to give them isn't working, we're available uh, for consult to give them additional supplement, additional support um, in that. So. Um, we understand that going through this process, not only detox, but also the long-term recovery and rehabilitation, it's a scary process. It's a scary process to take that first step, and it's a scary process to go through, and it's a scary process sometimes to keep going through. Um, it's oftentimes a huge change in somebody's life, um, both their daily routine, sometimes you know how they're living their life and everything. So our goal is to help them get safely through that, um, but also to help support them at each step of the way.